Did you know that there is a form field that you can add to ensure that your form submissions are actually coming from real people? Let me show you how with JotForms CAPTCHA. Hey JotFormers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly, and as you can see, I'm in the features landing page for Google reCAPTCHA. Now, this is a really great thing to add to your forms to ensure that every single form submission is coming from a real person and not a computer. So if you have any additional questions after watching this video, of course, leave us a comment down below, but definitely come back to this features landing page to get all of your questions answered. So let me go ahead and jump over to my Google dashboard. Now for this example, I'm going to go ahead and create a brand new form. So top left hand corner, let's do create form. And I'm going to go ahead and start from scratch on the classic form. And I'm going to go ahead and bring in a few normal form elements. So let's do full name and email. And as you can see, I'm just under the basic form elements. I'm not in widgets or anything like that. I'm going to go ahead and scroll down to the bottom of the basic elements. And right here we have the captcha. So I'm gonna go ahead and drag this into the bottom and we can see that it says, please verify that you are human. And now we can always edit this to make this however you want it to be. Let's go ahead and click on the properties and it's automatically set as a form default. Now, as if I click over here to advance, we can see that there's no way for me to turn off it being required. So that is a plus. There's no forgetting to make this field required. Now we can see that there's three different CAPTCHA types. The first one is going to be the H CAPTCHA. Next is going to be the reCAPTCHA. And again, I'm not a robot, but we can also turn this on to be invisible reCAPTCHA. So as this person is going through the process of filling out the form, if Google senses that this person might be a robot or a computer trying to fill out your form, they'll automatically kick on that reCAPTCHA. So if we turn this on, we can see that it is currently hidden. So let's preview the form. So we can see that it is not there. So if at any point as I'm filling this out, if it feels that I am not a human, it'll automatically pop up before we submit that form. If you want, you can turn that on. So that way, let's preview the form again. We can see that it's on, but it's not going to kick in unless JotForm it feels that that person is not a person and a computer. But let's do the Jot reCAPTCHA. This is where they're going to have to type something in in order to prove that they are a human, but it really is as simple as that. Let's go ahead and preview the form and we'll do fill form. And we can see, we can click right down here, I am a human. And here we can see it says, please click on the object that only appears once. So we can see this one right here is a little bit different than all of them. And next, only appears once. This one, verify and we are good to go, we can submit that form. And it really is as simple as that. If you have any other questions about how to add CAPTCHA to your forms, definitely let us know down below in the comments. And again, like I mentioned, be sure to check out that features landing page for even more information. If you like this video and you got some value, definitely hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notification every time we put out a new video. I'll see you next time.